the guess who is Steve and the drums and stuff. So my name is Hannah and I'm originally from the UK. I grew up in London and I lived there for most of my life but then I spent my 20s in Australia and I moved to the Netherlands about, I guess, th three years ago. Um, so my artist, his name is Paul Selu and he is also from the UK um, but he originally grew up in Gambia for um, his childhood and then he moved back to the UK where he lived with his parents and grew up in Coventry. The genre that he's coming from, um, I guess, would really be UK hip hop. And it seems that there's a bit of a mix of some grime in there and a bit of Afro beats. So really some styles that I would really uh, think of like when I'm thinking of UK music in that sense. Some brothers give in, some make it out. Some ain't got the heart, some behold the spirit. Some do it for the living, most do it for clout. Some do it for the money, the dollar, the pound. Some get it on their own, leech on their own. For the love of money, see niggas done on their own. Told me I can't do that, it don't make sense. You switch too fast, it's either the grave or pen. They told me I can't do that, it don't make sense. You switch too fast, it's either the grave or pen. It's not really a style of music that I grew up listening to a lot. I was really into a lot of more rock or jazz or things like that. And my older brother was really into hip hop, but it's quite funny because actually when I moved to Australia, it's a style of music I started to really get interested in because it really reminded me of home and it really reminded me of London. And when you think of hip hop, like you think of American hip hop and where its roots are, it really comes from the streets and UK hip hop, it's a little bit different. I mean, like I said, it's not a genre I listen to a lot of, but it's, it, wasn't just, it wasn't so typical of what I would think of for this genre maybe. So it was maybe just a little bit different. I think throwing some things in there from other styles, like I said, some of the grime and the Afro beat, but also being quite clear with his lyrics as well. It really, I think the lyrics maybe mean something. One of the songs I really liked was one called Energy, featuring Mahalia, which is a really nice female singer. And what I really liked about it is it's, it's called Energy and I think the main like, title of the song, the main themes that come out of the song are a line called Protect Your Energy. And it's actually quite a strong thing to say, but the way the music is, it's quite kind of calm and, you know, it just takes you along. And I think it's a really nice song to finish a, an album with or so, because it really makes you think. Why you keep this in your energy? Never let them blow out the energy. They just want your focus cause they're jealousy. Protect your energy. Protect your energy. Protect the energy. They just want your focus cause they're jealousy. Protect your energy. And I think a lot of it is about kind of where he grew up. I think the first mixtape, his debut um, like album that came out was, uh, I think it was, it's called Send Them to Coventry. So you can tell it's really about where he grew up and it's a lot of, you know, about growing up on the streets there and living there and coming from London. Like, I, I, it's a bit different and a bit further away, but it's a very similar kind of upbringing and the kind of societies you live in there and what you deal with and what you deal with in your peer groups and in your social groups and there's a lot of pressure and I think it's it's very easy for people to go the wrong direction and I think a lot of the lyrics are about this and about the pressures that he's getting from different parts of society and that he's trying to prove people wrong or the directions and the things that he's choosing so yeah it kind of has that true hip-hop soul to it where of like the kind of thing it's about uh, but yeah it's, it's quite cool. I, I remembered halfway through to like incorporate the questions, so I hope they were there. <laughs> I love that, really, so nice, like so nice input, really good. Oh, cool. Very good.